What's your uh, name? Tim Huber. Tim Huber. Hey, he's trying on our heroic uh, Kevlar hoodie and also checking out the the SPR Pros. What, what do you think about these gloves? Uh, really, really like the connection between the uh, basically pinky and the uh, ring finger. Okay. It doesn't allow the, as you were explaining, the uh, pinky to basically break or bend in a uh, small bow side. Uh, material and construction feels really good. It doesn't, you know, limit range or mobility, uh, at least in a game in a way that you kind of need on a motorcycle. Um, Palms, I really like that. I feel like not enough gloves or not enough manufacturers make gloves that have you know armor in the palms. Okay. Because you know that's the first thing that's going to make contact with the ground when you go down is it's going to be the palm. Right. Um, and so yeah, that's just, these are the two areas that your gloves going to eat through basically in the event of a slide. So yeah, it's you know it's practical and intuitive and you know again I see you know certain kind of features that are pretty common you know across the board. But other areas the. I guess, would you say frame or chassis of the glove? Is that yeah, the correct kind of terminology? Um, it feels a little bit like stronger, back back. Um, a little more solid than I guess, like, at least the gloves I personally am. Um, I feel like you wear it up, less up than safe. Yeah, no, very, very much so. Um, I'd be interested to see how it feels after, like, six months of riding, as far as I imagine the you know, structure really it's going to hold up. It's so yeah, right, probably, right. like, yeah. loosen up a little bit or become a little bit more like, comfortable, especially yeah. depending on, like, the size of your pants and stuff like that. Now, what about that hoodie? Because you're wearing that hoodie like it was your second skin. It feels like a sweatshirt. Um, you know, other than the area where you actually have the armor, you know, in the jacket itself, okay. um, it feels like a hoodie. And especially with the armor being removable, um, it feels like a normal sweatshirt. Okay. You know, as far as, like, moving around off the bike, restriction doesn't, you know, movement doesn't feel weird or anything. Um, now, Tim, how can people find you? Uh, Tim Hubermoto, Instagram, Twitter, Twitter. Uh, on Bike Curious, Revzilla, yeah, Bike Curious, Ride Apart, uh, a handful of other, uh, Eat Sleep Ride, uh, EDB Moto Magazine, and the most recent issue, uh, a handful of other publications. Uh, yeah. Thank you for stopping by. Yeah.